They have brought new life to this fire as it continues to push through El Dorado County. We'll show you what to expect over the next couple of days. This is KCLA 3. We begin with breaking news. A major development at the Caldor fire burning in El Dorado County. The fire has now jumped Highway 50 just east of Kuipers. A shift in the wind has fire crews digging in tonight as they battle this fire. The weather having an impact on the fire's behavior, its intensity, and also the effort to contain it. One of the best ways to demonstrate this is with Live Capture 3. Over the past couple of days, we couldn't get to this fire. It was too smoky. The visibility was too poor, but that has changed. The wind has blown out a lot out of the smoke and while the wind is fanning the flames to the north and east it's also allowing cal fire to bring in the aircraft it needs to attack the fire from up above as of right now the caldor fire has burned more than 82,000 acres and at this time there is no containment good evening we have live team coverage on this fire chief meteorologist mark finan is tracking the weather but we start along highway 50 near kybers and that is where we find kcra3 stephanie lynn with the very latest on this fire stephanie yeah, Walter, this certainly is a very concerning situation, both for firefighters and residents who are probably watching this, waiting with bated breath to find out the status of their homes and whether those homes lie in the line of the Caldor fire. Let's take you straight up to that hillside behind me.